I saw weird glitches with these guys. Uh, they, like, I saw like them just spawn and they were spinning all over the place. But anyway, here we are. Let's get some water going. We can make the sea glide finally. I can do both. But... Oh, I don't think I have copper to do that. No, you need two. Oh, of course. <laughs> uh, it's always something. Copper's usually in this direction. Oh, I didn't scan the boomerang fish yet. Copper should be in this area because there's a lot of creep vines. I do like the newer textures for them. It, they, I think it has more detail. The original green ones didn't have much to them. There's actually a new item pickup in the game. I found it in the incomplete filled fill area. It has no item icon yet. It has artwork, but not 3D model yet. So it's just a square box. Oh, here we go. Should get. To, oh, I found some coral here. That's rare. Oh, uh, I made it a little bit easier with table coral, because when you, you it cuts into multiple pieces now. I guess. Oh, I found silver, so I can actually make a high capacity. Let me see if I can. Put it on. Thirty seconds. Good. I got lucky on that. Good. Got copper. I'm full anyway. Oxygen. Uh, no, I have oxygen. See, I don't know why it resets that. Oh, I did the seeds. Oh, but my inventory's full. Oh, I actually hang on. I can quickly eat stuff. I don't want to toss. Well, actually, you know what? I'll toss the. I'll toss the titanium. A new sound. That's why I like that new sound effect. Glide model's pretty much the same from the original game. I don't see any difference. Oh, yeah, I wanted to make the high capacity tank. I almost forgot. Uh, actually, I need glass. I'm not sure if I have enough. Let me see. What is it for? Oh, I was wondering why you weren't here. I forgot you had to download it. Well, I had actually an issue. Uh, when I was downloading the game when it launched, what happened was, it was quite funny. Uh, they had released the game, they launched it live, and when you, I, I, you know, I bought it right away, got it, and I installed it, but it installed in like half a second. And at first they were saying, oh, it was Steam's fault, there was some sort of glitch that you needed to refresh. I had a refresh, I deleted my uh, download cache, and nothing worked. Then what happened later on, the guy who said everything was fine, he came up into the live stream and said, well, we kind of screwed something up and forgot to link the correct uh, folder. So literally it was just an empty folder every time you downloaded it. That's why it wasn't working. He fixed it like in 30 minutes and we downloaded it and I started playing, it was fine. But it was funny that they goofed up. High capacity tank. So you get, you see the cool model? They don't change the icon. And they don't change nothing. It's just like they still, to this day, I really wish they would fix that. It's so annoying because you think you have the standard oxygen tank because they don't change anything. Let's see. I need to make another one, right? Can I make another one? Yeah, we need two more glass and one, three more titanium. Just switch that over. No. Uh, right now, we can't do anything with the station. It talks to us, but we can't because we haven't had the rocket yet. I, don't, I bet you we probably will never be able to go to the station. I bet you it's just our communication line. That's why we don't have the radio in the game anymore. All right, so now I'm good on that. So I got my sea glide. I got two oxygen tanks. Let's switch over to the other one. All right, can we can actually go start exploring? Let me just reorganize these. Oh, this way. I usually have it in this order. All right, uh, let's see. What should we explore first? I do need to trigger a... Oh, that was weird. Oh, yeah, it was the first time look. I forgot. <laughs> Works same way as the original one. So far, I think nothing. There's no vehicles in the game currently right now. I ha Unless I, ha I haven't found anything, I don't think there's anything available. I know I have to go deep down and it triggers a dialogue. 
Let's see where it is. Okay. Am I in the right area? No, I'm in the Arctic Kelp. That's not the correct area. Here, Twisty Bridges. I need to go down. It's nighttime. It makes it worse. I know it's going to start complaining that I don't have the uh, rebreather, which I haven't found yet. Oh, there's the exploding fish! A little bit laggy here. Oh, yeah, you can see it. Got the sulfur so I can make my repair tool. Yeah, they're back. There, there seem to be not many, though. I have only found it in this lower area. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen uh, efficiency greatly decreased. Yes. This area that you see here, I think it's for storing purposes. And I know uh, later on, uh, I, I think uh, a dialogue will be triggered at some point. But it's there's an empty room. Maybe I have to wait until the morning. It might not work at night. Or you have to wait a certain amount of days. I'm not sure what triggers it. I've got a lead for oh, you. Here we go. An alien sanctuary in the Twisty Bridges. 200 meters down. I need to go back to the research site. I can't let you. Why not? Boss's orders. We're trying to keep you alive. Only because salaries cost less than lawsuits. Is that cynicism making you friends down there? Sure. They're just not human. I the files are on your data bank. Do as you please, just tell me what you find. And don't get me into trouble. Yeah. I'm starting to think this is kind of like an alien Waylon yutani thing where... For some reason, we're not allowed to go back to the station and get a rescue ship. I I'm thinking there's some sort of something going on. But yeah, she the the uh, what we what we get the data bank. Yeah. This we this location that they say you have to go into this lower air. I haven't found it. I think I found the room, but there's nothing in there. So I'm thinking that's where the end of the story is. Unless I'm just in a completely wrong area. She said it's like 200 meters down below in the twisty area, right? Which I found, and I was like, Passing I have 100 meters, and I hadn't found any type. Decreased. I hadn't found any uh, thing that looked like the sanctuary precursor door, and then I found, and I went further you down. You're GPS. You're close to the sanctuary. Do you see anything? Oh. Some alien structures dotted about. I'll see where they lead. Well, I, I've been looking around and. I went in this purple Passing area. 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. I hate when it freezes like that. Does this just purple area just go down, down, down? Then from the map, you, you could see that it's just nothing. Although you see like a hole over there. There's literally nothing in here but just walls. So I'm not sure if it's supposed to be in here or something. I have no idea. I mean, it's possible I'm just missing something. 30 seconds. Let me switch on. Oxygen. Please tell me I didn't do something stupid. I did something stupid! I'm gonna die now because I didn't refill the other tank. Ah. Uh, well, you get to see the death animation, which is pretty much the same. Ah. Uh, what did I lose? I forgot to refill my tank. Huh. It made me keep the sulfur, which pretty much is what I cared about. That's the one thing I hate about the game. It doesn't warn you that you didn't fill your tank. Like your secondary tank. It doesn't It doesn't warn you. There should be some sort of indicator for air for the other tanks. And why do you have to switch to it? Shouldn't you be able to get... If you're carrying the oxygen tank on you in the magic pocket, whatever it is, shouldn't it automatically refill? But I should actually show you the areas that are incomplete. Um, let me see. There is a Leviathan in this direction, if I'm correct. <laughs> Gotta go like a thousand meters away from the pod. It was a really cool area that I found in the first playthrough. I'm not sure if I can find it again. Because I was just underneath the uh, ice and I found a hole and it led into an open above water cave. And it then went into this big area that kind of reminds me of Fenadria Drifts from Metroid Prime. And it's just like a completely incomplete area. Just temporary textures, walls. And then I eventually got stuck because the walls are uh, behind a hollow on one end. And then I went through them and I died because I got stuck. I do miss having the battery indicator on the HUD of the Sea Glide rather than the text. 
Uh, there's also giant lily pads in this game. I saw the artwork and I wasn't sure if they were going to be in the game, but they are here. Am I getting closer? I think so. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here's the giant lily pads. Usually there's a leviathan around them. There we go. We, I don't... Can we scan it? I never had a chance to scan it. No. So they don't have a model yet. I oh these guys here we go I found the gel set I didn't notice it oh there I think that was a Leviathan right there the, good or bad I don't know uh oh let me save just in case I saw it because I don't know if it's a good or the good one from what we released or a bad one I, I'm not sure because they could be all grown up is that it no that's a rock it's one of these rocks. what the freak is it yeah these guys are over here. I would probably have been died there if I hadn't re died before and reset my health. Yeah, see, I thought I was out of bounds because this water would do this dark blue stuff. But I'm not. Nothing has, like... Oh, that's a bad glitch. Oh, I didn't know... Oh. Oh, this there's one There's one that's not, like, opened up. Yeah, that's cool. I never noticed that. That's pretty cool. Where's that Leviathan? Some roots. Ah, uh, see, I found here's the um. It's rare to find the ruby, but it's over here. I don't think you can get on the top of the lily pad. I tried. Yeah, see, you just float through it. I don't know why this. I guess it's just not solid yet. Okay, let's see. I'm tr still trying to find that leviathan. That's three lily pads. I haven't explored this whole area. <laughs> oh, is there a hole here? Hello? Oh, I didn't know there was an interior to this. It's pretty cool. Maybe they'll put something in here later. They've done that before in the first game. Oh, there's land over here. That's... Crossing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Hmm, there's a lot of vines here. I never noticed this area. This is new to me. How? Where am I exactly? I should put a beacon here. Just for the hell of it. I'll just leave it here for now. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Yeah, I'm going into a cave when I'm low on air. That's smart of me. I better actually leave right now. Oh. 30 seconds. Uh, let me just switch over to this. Oh, yeah, I meant to scan you. Rock puncher? Oh, hello! Uh, rifle fragment! Oh, cool! So there's a rifle fragments in the game already. So we do get the weapon for the stasis. It's just over here. I- they really don't know. There's no information on the Aurora at all. We just start the game immediately in Robin's quarters, and then she gets out of the place, so we don't really know how far. Yeah, there's a lot of seam issues, which is common in the original game until they fix them. There's something up there, which I don't know what it is. It could be something important, but I really want to find that Leviathan. Where the freak is it? Oh, yeah, we have... Okay, I'm in this area. This is these uh, heat area, the heat vents. It should give us damage. No? Okay, so maybe they didn't plant it yet. It's probably be a good place for ch uh, so, uh, heat power and so Oh, hello. Oh no, I think it's the whale thing. Where is it though? I'm seeing a shadow of it, but I'm not seeing the guy itself. Oh, uh, game, is he in the floor? Cause they have new whales. There's new stuff. Oh, here, here's some mistakes here. They kind of look like whales slash walruses. I forgot that what they were called new creature discovered. Yeah, that's the Arctic Peeper. That's one of the new things. Yeah, this area has a whole bunch of these. Oh, hello. I think that's a new fish. Or is that the penguin? Yeah, it's the penguin. Or the penguin. There we go. Uh, we're near one of the uh, unfinished areas. Here we go. All temporary stuff. I'm assuming this will be an ice wall when they actually put it in. Right now, it's just this white thing. I haven't found any glitches to get through it, though. 
this is the one thing I hate about the game is that it needs a map. It really needs a map. They don't seem to do anything. They don't attack. Oh, they do. Ah, okay, they do. You have to be in the front. Okay, so they can injure you. You gotta be careful. These guys are here. Oh, crap. The worst time to do this. Can I get up here? I haven't had a chance to get up on shore. There we go. Do I have anything to eat or yeah, I have just you, right? Vital signs stabilizing. You can actually consume the gel sacks. Not really advisable, but Yeah, let's see if there's anything up here. I mean this could be just the old research area. I mean, this would be a good place to start a base, too. There are a lot of lights here. Hello. Ah, hello. There might be a research of some kind that we must have set up initially in the game. Aren't these, like, like kind of land versions of um, the blue orbs but without the blue? What is, I wonder what's making that noise. Is that just water flashing, or is there actually something here? I didn't make the flashlight, so I gotta use this. I know there's a research thing I saw up there. Let's see, where's this cave go? It's gotta be just the water. Oh, they actually close up. I guess maybe when they're in the dark, these guys close up, and then when you get near them, they open up. That's cool. Let's see if there's a way to get on to the upper level, because I see a platform. I wish it was daylight. I should put a beacon up here. So I know how to get back. Hang on. <laughs> it, it just, oh, hello, hello. I found a, I found a base. Ah, cool, I didn't know there was a base in here. That's cool. You get to see some of the newer parts. That's cool. So they did something. Is there anything here? Oh, hang on. Oh, I got some power in this. Anything here before I go to the base? I don't know what I'm hearing. I, too bad you can't scan these to get the light sticks. All right, let's go in the base. Oh, there's a solar panel. I don't know if we can scan them. All right, so we found a base. Fan chair. Bar table. Well, we got an empty locker. So we can interact with the, this area. Ah, we got the fabricators. So, so technically we already have a base that we could use. Interesting, so they kind of gave you stuff. So you could just make a quick base this way. That's pretty cool. Oh, we got a nutrition block from here. Which the, this lighting glitch still happens in the game, unfortunately. You're gonna give me a cup or what? There we go. Cup of Joe. Oh, hello. Interesting. Oh, it's damaged, though. Mm, that lock. Oh, hello, sleep. We can actually sleep! Hey, we got something to sleep on. I can actually sleep to the day. Blueprint I'm glad I kept exploring because I had thought this wasn't in the game. So maybe I'm wrong. There's still more stuff to explore. That's good. Multi. Oh, here we got to scan the multi pro Blueprint acquired. Oh, cool. I was wondering how we would be able to find all the items. Blueprint Alright, so we can sleep. Let me just quickly do that. All right, cool. Calorie intake recommended. Oh, I got this. I got that. So far, there's no clock. They said they wanted to implement a clock in the game, so I'm, I'm assuming we'll be able to do that. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. We can't climb up the ladder? What? This ladder's non-functional? Ah, oh, bogus. That's just bizarre. 
So we can't go up there. Ah! I wanted a rocket! Hello? Does this work? Is this functional? Can I scan it? Is it, is this usable at all? Maybe this is how we can, oh, it's called an exchanger. So maybe this is how we get items from the base. Does it work? <laughs> is it implemented in the game yet? Hello, there is an icon on the thing. Is it damaged? Rocket needs repair. Oh, uh, yeah, great. Of course it does. And, oh, maybe that's why they have the repair tool in the game. So it's possible I need to use the repair tool in order to repair the rocket. Here, oh, hello. What's that? Is that supposed to be a way to swim in? What is that? Or, or is it a spring? I think they were talking about making springs. Maybe that's one of the springs that they just didn't implement yet. Yeah, those look like springs. Yeah. Yeah, it does look like a hot tub with the temp. Oh, I don't know if I should do this. Let me see. I'll just check these. Yeah, they're springs. They're just not not complete. I saw them in a dev uh, update. They were trying to make these work. They said, I think they said they're going to update the springs next week or in, in the, fo <coughs> the following week. Well, either way, I'll head back here and see if I can get it repaired by making the repair tool. First things first is to get back to the base. New creature discovered. Vital signs stabilizing. Okay, so either way I'm good, but I still need to make the repair tool, so it's not like I'm wasting time. Hello. Yeah, it's titanium, wasn't gold. Can I scan you? No. Can I scan you? No. I'm glad there's more stuff inside the game, because I really thought once I got to that dialogue, there was nothing else. Let's see, can I make that tool? Oh, I just need the rubber. Oh, oh, yeah, I found aerogel. Yeah, it's true, because I found the thing, so I can't make the aerogel. Yeah, here we go. Perfect. Tools. Repair tool. All right, I will pick up water. Okay, let me see if I can find the bladder. Oh, hang on. Okay, that's a bad glitch. If you g grab one and you're scanning, you can complete the scan, but it, that's a bad cheat. All right, let's head back to that place. Hopefully I can figure out how to get back up there. Obviously people will make a walkthrough of some kind on game facts, and I can check it later to see if I missed anything. Please be gold. Ah, good gold. I think that's my first gold. Oh, actually, I need to scan. Yes, yeah, oh, ah. Scan, scan, scan. Thank you. Goodbye. They do have two different sound effects depending on like where you get injured. If you're in the water, she does that. But if she's on land, she does a different noise. I, I, I really hate this. I really do. It's like can't your character cannot run on land holding the sea glide in front of you. It, it's the same BS with uh, Doom 3. You can't hold the gun and the stupid light at the same time. It's like where's the logic in that? I think her hand had bent a little too much. All right, let me see if this is gonna work. Oh, hello. Speaking of damage. Hello, storage unit. To send request items. This might be the uh, way to get items from somewhere. Interesting. I don't know what, I'll, I'll send the penguin. <laughs> See if it works. Does this work? Oh, this needs repairing as well. Waiting for cargo. Well, I just put something in there. Yeah, that's what I'm assuming. But I put something in there. That doesn't count as cargo? So right now, I bet you it's just not functional. All right, let me see if I can find that Leviathan. Cause is this supposed to be out of the water? Are you supposed? Usually they're not supposed to be. No, it's definitely not. It spawned in the wrong area. Yeah, well, I gotta fix that. <laughs> I remember in the original game, almost everything spawned in the sky at some point. Plants, fish. I remember a Leviathan spawned in the sky. It was very weird. They would get stuck up in the sky. Sometimes they would fall down. I know I got killed by one. 
I don't get it. I, I went into the area that had the lily pads, and it immediately spawned right in front of me the very first time I went in the area. Now I don't find it. How do you miss King Leviathans? I didn't know these were in the game. These are actually new. Generic bowl? Really? There's no, there's no name for it? Yeah, I guess they didn't name it yet. Where am I exactly anyway? Purple vents? They call this purple. Uh, here, here's more stuff that spawned in the air. Uh, yeah, you're not definitely. Uh, can I grab anything? My no, I'm too low. Uh, I'm too low. Damn it. It's funny. Oh, here we go. There it is. There it is. There it is. Now let's see if it kills me. Uh, actually, let me see. Uh, I don't want to die and then lose all this. Let's see if you kill me. You gonna kill me or you have weird pathing problems? You're getting stuck. Maybe that's why I couldn't find it the first time. He has weird glitches. Yeah, kill me. You're gonna kill me or not? Oh, come on. You're telling me he doesn't see me by now? I'm, st I'm still hoping he's one of the ones that you released in the first game and just grew up. Uh, okay. You're gonna kill me? Yeah, it seems that he's good. The stalker hates you more than him. Yeah, so I guess we have to assume this is one of the little baby versions that's all grown up. Because he's not killing me. Oh, hello. Did he, he still makes the enzyme? Is this the enzyme? Or is this a Oh, uh, yeah. Concentrated enzyme 42. Yeah, so that confirms it. It is the baby from the first games. He still makes the enzyme. Oh. Why didn't the audio trigger? Oh, maybe they didn't finish it. That probably is a story point. They didn't finish it. That's cool. So, uh, Enzyme 42 is still part of the story, I guess. I wonder if we can, I, mean, I wonder if in the future we can grow them in the, like, the temp, like, the thing. Because it's right now, oh, they're hollow. They're not even, oh, that's why we can't go on the lily pants. They don't even have solid collisions yet. So, they're decorative currently. You know, for being the very first early access, you know, hopefully they fix more of the texture issues, like these repeating textures over there in the mountains. It'd be nice if we at some point could get to the Aurora, but I'm I'm really thinking we probably never will, but maybe we'll interact with it somehow, maybe at least get a mention from the station at some point in the story. Like, oh yeah, we took it apart and salvaged it, something like that. Maybe the guy we played in the first game is on the station, who knows? 